I was thinking of wearing a tie. I thought that was a little too much, but I'm going to pull my collar up, do that, and uh, do that. <laughs> I'm Bobby Hutchison, and this is my night in the life. My morning routine is a little different. I get up in the morning, make myself a nice hot cup of coffee, watch a little bit of the news. Then I watch The Price is Right. I've been watching The Price is Right for must be 20 years. Then I go to my little office room, and my instrument's sitting there, and it's sort of like saying, hey, Bob, come on over here and play a couple notes. And I said, OK. Today, I'm going to the beach. Then I'm going to SF Jazz to see my son, Teddy, and Randall Klein. And later today, I have an interview with jazz journalist Andy Gilbert. I used to go to the beach when I was younger because uh, I loved to fish. I bought a Boston whaler. Everybody started hearing that I was fishing. And Ray Drummond, he started calling me Captain Bob. I worked in a lot of the clubs in New York, like Birdland, you know, the Half Note Slugs and places like this. Slugs, to me, was the real proving ground. Third Street between B and C, I mean, it was in the bowels of New York where you, you come in there and it's sawdust on the floor and there's gonna be people having fights. And you have to really make the people sit down and listen to the music. In those days, in order to work at a nightclub, you had to have a, what was called a cabaret card. The cabaret card, my cab license was taken away from me. And I uh, came back out to California, my hometown, Pasadena. Things had started to change a little. And I heard that uh, a friend of mine, Delano Dean, opened a uh, jazz club in San Francisco called The Both End. When I came to San Francisco, I had already recorded a couple albums on Blue Note. So I, you know, I thought I was hot stuff. And I go to the both end, and there's a band playing, and I walk to the door, and Rosemary's standing there taking the tickets for people to come in. She says, ticket please. And I said, I don't need a ticket. She says, oh yes you do. She says, you wanna come in? I said, yes I do. She says, tickets please. I said, I don't need it. My name is Bobby Hutchinson. She says, I don't care who you are. And then Leno heard this, and he walked over, and he says, that's Bobby Hutchinson. He can come in. She says, oh, OK. Next night, I decided to come. Hi. Hello, tickets, please. I liked it the, the way that she wouldn't let me in. This beautiful girl, she's become even more beautiful since, since we've been together. We've been together for 41 years now. And she's, boy, I'm a lucky guy. <laughs>